All right, we're going back to the Talos 1 lobby, and uh, it's been a weekend, so I don't really remember what the fuck I was doing. But I'm pretty sure we're on our way to the trauma center to find... Oh, no, I remember where we are. I just killed the big flaming fuckhead. Ah. Now, if I remember correctly, there's another one over here. That I'd prefer to use a shotgun on. Oh, jeez. Yeah, alright. So, if we just do a little sneaky peek. Don't see anyone. Huh, alright. Alright, so yeah, I think... I think I got... <clears throat> I think I got them all. Put that fire out. There we go. Biohazard. Yeah. Fuck you, shithead. Alright, so let's just grab this out. Got some nice toolboxes. Got a note. Please, 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 with a cherry on top, fix the medical operator that's been sitting on your desk. System alert. Repair is needed. You. I can't repair you. That's a shame. A broken cooler fan. Random shit. Got a microwave. Alright, that's a ton of randoms. Alright, let's, uh... Wow, I have a lot of shit. Alright, uh, why to sort? I don't have any neuromods that I can use to get repaired to, do I? I don't, no. On the plus side, if I... Once I find another recycler, I'll be able to make a lot more ammo, I think. Petri dish. Med kit fabrication. That's probably important. No password found. Alright, well, wait. Good I morning, it. Talos. Our resident counselor... Dr. Cole would like to encourage anyone experiencing symptoms of disturbed sleep, chronic stress, or anxiety to schedule an appointment in the trauma center. Requesting new operator. Hello, are you here for an appointment? Diagnosing. Operator ready to deploy. Please stand clear of aperture. All right. Well, that's a that's a new one. I feel like this guy's about to come back to life. System alert. Repair is needed. Please All right. Well, on the plus side, on the plus side, he didn't come back to life. <laughs> it's a quarantine over there, which does not sound like fun. What is this? A psychostimulant that increases the psychic potential of an individual when injected. Stores 60 side points. Oh, so I gotta I gotta clean up my fucking inventory here. Alright. Uh I feel like I should probably upgrade. I mean obviously I should just use this immediately. Should I upgrade the firepower recoil ammo capacity? I mean ammo capacity is useful, but a silenced pistol with increased Firepower could be nice as well. That's a tricky one. And then I could do the glue cannon as well. For increased range, but I'm not too interested in that. I feel like I'm kind of running at things head-on a lot more, so I'm, I'm going to upgrade the shotgun with uh, uh, some ammo capacity. Yeah, I feel like that was a smart decision. Uh, suit repair kit. I don't really need to use a suit repair kit or anything. Oh. Oh, oh, I know what I... Okay, so this is like... Kind of Petrus now. It can only fit in a, in a specific way, so you have to move things around in order to fit it in your inventory. That's cool. Trash 
Trevor J. Young, mind controlled. Subject, Trevor J. Young. Subject appears disoriented, paranoid, not sure how much of current behavior is due to the incident versus his recent neuromod removals. Recommend continued observation. Sunburst banana pudding. Sly hip, no. But he's just real aggressive now. I could hack it if I wanted to. I don't really know why I'd do that. It. What? Seven, three, two, four. The Verizon seven, three, two, four. Welcome. Maybe Devries, I can help you. Seven, three, two, four. Wait, where's the code that I need? Oh, I bet you it's this code. Ah, Alright. I was wrong. But it does say something about, like, DeVry's 7324. Nice to see you. There's a lot of various noises that goes on in this game. And they aren't nearly as fun as I wanted them to be. Needed. Please contact a qualified engineer. I'm definitely not a qualified engineer. I'm not too interested in any of this shit. So... Uh... Objectives. I'm an idiot. Get Bellamy's room key from his body in Psychotronics. Found that Bellamy's corpse is actually located in Psychotronics. Hello, nice to see you. So, is this Psychotronics? No, that's just cure pharmaceuticals. All right. So, let's see, where is Psychotronics? Psychotronics is level B1. Hmm. Alright, well, I want to go up to my room and use the bloody recycler. Because that sounds like something that uh, I kind of need to do. Uh, auto sword? No, wait. F. Transfer junk. There we go. Alright. And recycle. Lovely. Uh, let's just grab that stuff. So I can make a med kit, but I, what I really want is shotgun shells. I want more shotgun shells. <laughs> Alright. I feel slightly more confident now that I have a good amount of shotgun shells. I also really love this gun. It looks dope. Not this. Um, but, oh, wait, there we go. Shotgun. <sighs> Alright, so. We need to go to B1, I think it was. So, how the hell do you go down a level, I wonder? Staff lounge, yeah, I security, I already cleared this place out. Restrooms look very interesting. I'm curious, can you just. Oh, yeah, you can just smash your way in. Alright. That's good to know. Is 
So, what killed you, then? Is it this? He looks like he just starved to death. Because he's not, like, mutilated or anything. Whatever. Alright, where are we going here? Employee orientation? Hmm. Oh, hey, an apple. Yeah, so that's where I came from. That's where I kind of need to go. So I guess I'll just go over there next. I can like grab. Wait, no, no. Nineteen sixty-three. Fuck. <sighs> ah, fuck me. That really made me jump. Where the fuck am I going? All right, all the way up here. In the telecom. Oh wait, have I not? Oh, I guess I haven't been in here. All right. Broken. Oh, I can actually repair it. All right. All right. So uh, that's that's neat. All right. Let's go to the next area. Uh, confirm. Alright. Oh, God. Uh. Proceed to sneak if you wish to avoid direct confrontation. How about I want. What? What? What if I wish to avoid all confrontation? Oh, fire! That's not fun. Alright, so don't stand close to those. Got it. I bet you I, if I had higher skills, I could have gone and, like, fixed him from behind or something. I want that. I wanted that. Hey, I sent Larson to the demo theater to see if he could sink a bottle of old Sadar. Join us, demo delay. Hope. Just a heads up that Artax propulsion system demo will have to be delayed. We're still working on this like calibration to do in the machine shop and something about it. Got a wrench. Got a e pad. What's that wet noise? I guess it's from that? Eh. There's definitely a mimic in here, right? Well, that's not good for that person. Like, just saying. It's really not good for that one person. Man, I got so much green tea. 
Not interested. Ooh, an asteroid fragment. Hey, this looks like a jumping puzzle. Don't it? Wait, no, wait. What? I thought you could, like... Oh, there we go. me figuring stuff out that's not what I wanted I wanted that All right. break rooms always great places to look for snacks uh, wait there we go ooh weapon upgrade kit Got some more. Fuck me. Why? Why? Alright, 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 alright. All right. Let's look at this shit. Alright, we have. What? Why do we have two glue cannons? And other shit. Alright, so, well, let's eat some stuff. Alright. That was wholly unhelpful. But I need to I need to go back and find that I, I need to go back and use that recycling. Ow. Yes, confirm. So I have like extra glue cannons and shit like that. I did not realize that I was actually picking the materials up. I thought I was, uh, I thought it was like, you know, if you pick up a weapon you already have, then you just get the ammo for it. And I was picking up those wrenches because I was like, I don't know, I probably just get spare parts. Uh, I was fucking wrong. Alright, well, glad I just repaired this thing. So, let's, uh, let's transfer junk. And then, uh, transfer that and that. And I have a ton of other shit, I guess. Let's auto sort. So yeah, let's uh let's, let's go, let's make some shit. Alright, so I guess I should really stop just picking everything up. No, I'm I'm used to having like I'm used to playing Dishonored, where it's like, you know, pick everything up because you don't have an inventory size. I mean, you do, but it'll just say you can't pick this up for bullets and stuff. It's not like I'm going to miss out on a weapon upgrade because I can't pick it up like I am in this game. So that's going to be a little bit different. I heard the inventory is uh, very similar to something like Resident Evil 7 or something. I think that was it. Ooh, wow, I just shot across the floor like for some reason. Um, anyways... I never played that game, because that is even scarier than this one. And, uh, I'm a scaredy cat, so yeah. Alright, I'll just take the ammo. And I shouldn't have picked that up, whatever. So yeah, there's something making sounds. The Phantom. There's a turret? Some oh, there's a turret over there. Huh. Alright, hear me out. Oh, what? can't, like, build a bridge? Shit. <laughs> that was so anticlimactic. No, you can do, though. Boom. There's... Jorgen, Thorgen, Thorgen, Forgenstein. Oh, 
Oh, alright. Walks over there. Then heads over there. Gotta stay kind of close, otherwise the uh, door will close. If he heads to the right, I'm gonna move in to the left. E S plus X E. All right, so let's see. E S plus X E. Boy, uh, this is very dishonored. E S. Okay, well Xenon I know is or over here. Fifty four. E S. What the fuck is E S? E S. Ninety nine. Fifty four. Ninety nine. Fifty four. Boom. Nailed it. Ooh, what are these? All right, thank you. <laughs> Ask and I shall know. When detonated, the recycler charge breaks down the molecular structure of nearby objects into recyclable material. Your uniform offers some degree of protection, but it's not a failsafe. Standing too close can prove hazardous. Recycling, uh, recycler charges can be thrown or fixed to stationary objects using mouse one. If I just like press mouse one to place, well, why would I do that? All right, whatever. Bob! <laughs> oh, fuck me, where did it go? Jesus Christ. Huh? Yeah, bitch. Fucking hell. All right. <sighs> Let's try these stairs again. Oh, this just takes me down to where I was. Ah, oh, but it was locked. Interesting. All right, let's go back up. And then through here. Wow, that is a that is a far lean. Fuck me.
Yeah, you're, you're... Listen, buddy, you're really gonna have to die. Ooh. All right. Oh, I think I hear another one. That's a wrench, I don't need that. Oh, it's that thing. All right. Let's just move slow. I can repair that turret. I cannot repair that turret. Drats. Uh, feed this to an ENG operator after you memorize group workstation's password. Roll. Well, I, uh, I think I know the password, guys. To whomever gave Mr. Gluey McGlueface arms, aka first shift, I bow to thee. At first, I thought the jelly deal hat could not be popped. I stand corrected. Your triumphant creation of baseball glove hands cannot be equaled. Sincerely, then, were the second shift. Alright. Hello, this is a reminder that if you need supplies from the machine shop, the supply clause code is 6688. If you take anything, please let me know. Alright, that's lovely. Um. That's not what I wanted to do. Alright, so there's a supply closet with a code of 6688. As we've learned earlier, you don't actually need to memorize the code, thankfully. Ah, so this is what he was talking about. Note. Hello, my name is Mr. Gluey McGlueface. So there's some... I just punch you all apart. There's some stuff. Hey, Jelly Deals! Yeah, that's a dishonored. Asteroid fragments, I feel, are, vul are probably vulnerable. Yeah, no, valuable. I feel like that's a, a, a thing I should probably be getting. Alright, I'm in the atrium. A lot of the station tech starts here. Lab equipment, special parts requests, prototypes. We should be able to fix your looking glass terminal from Dr. Calvino's workshop. Beams and Waves Lab. Mustard Lab. That side of the lab was breached. Hard vacuum, no gravity. There's an exterior airlock in the machine shop you could use to reach him. You'll have to upgrade your suit with a propulsion system first. Oh, hey, look, a keycard. Wait, didn't I pick up a Neuromod? I, I have nine Neuromods. Christ. Alright, um... Hacking. Engineer, I want to be able to fucking... Leverage. Repair two. Yes, term. Lovely, alright. What's this? Uh, breakdown equipment in your inventory and spare parts and spare parts for destroyed operators. Suit modification and inv extra inventory space. Eh, whatever. Increases damage with security weapons. Yeah, definitely, definitely want that. Um, and then I have, I have one neuromod left, so I can grab leverage one, or I can grab. Oh, yeah, let's grab leverage. I'm gonna be able to move things around relatively easily. Alright, so I went for Repair 2 instead of Hacking 2. Don't know if that's the right idea, but yeah, I can repair most things now, so that's nice. There's a thing. Well, something was started to detect me. Uh, I'd say it was that thing. Let's just be a little sneaky little snake and get over to the med bay here. After I check out this person. 
I got a EMP charge. All right. The EMP charge emits a large burst of electromagnetic energy, highly effective against robots, turrets, and other electrical-based entities. It can be thrown or fixed to stationary objects using mouse one. So these are a bit like uh, the traps you could use in this uh Spring razors? Yeah, spring razors. Alright, so I, I can... Requesting new operator. Oh, there's a maintenance hatch there. Doperino. Hello. Good to see you again, Doctor Yu. Medical class operator, ready to deploy. Please clear the voucher. Wait, what did it become? I saw one. I thought it said Activision. There we go. Uh, fuck me. Ah, uh, fuck, I can't see shit. It's so dark. Christ. Alright. I couldn't see jack fucking shit. Alright. Hey, I have an excuse to eat things now. Uh, yes. Eat. 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 Uh, Sun-dried tomato. Meat. Ew. Stores five health points. Stores five health points. All right. Hey, did I pick up a weapon upgrade kit? I feel like I did. Yeah. All right. Uh, combine with. Let's do Mr. Shotgun. So we could do recoil or firepower. I, I want a really powerful fucking shotgun. So I'm gonna do uh, whatever I just did. Firepower. <laughs> Literally just said the name and I couldn't remember it. Oh! Alright. that I might be able to... I mean, I know I can fix. New supervisory override. Received. Oh, shit. Do not stand up. Logging self-diagnostic. List. Repair and maintenance protocols. Files not found. Oh, oh, shit, that's radioactive. Uh, get me the fuck away from here. <laughs> so there's fucking radioactive shit over there. There's some um, EMP charges, I think that's what that is, over there. Disintegrated circuit found new instructions. I think my best bet is just to activate that turret and then kind of stand by it and try and help it uh, not die to these corrupted things. But I'm not sure the turret will actually- shit, I'm not sure the turret will actually know to fire on the corrupted. Except, no, it says scanning for... But it's- oh, it's always a- it's code- it's- Fuck me! The corrupted are saying that the code is corrupted. So I don't know if the turret will detect that they're enemies. And if they don't, if the turret doesn't detect that they're enemies, then it renders me going and fixing the turret practically useless. 
because there's only one of the mimics. I feel like the corrupted should be blind. Alright, so we got the one going over there and the one heading right towards me and it. So like How do I zoom? Oh yeah, it's it. Let's see. Alright. What if I just like it's silence, so could I just like Files corrupted, but list serious service Alright. Oh, that's interesting. I tagged it. Hey, ain't that neato? Please move along, sir. There's nothing for you here. Hey guys, I think the turret was a good idea. I, I, I think the turret was a really good idea. Just gonna grab that. New supervisory override something's broken. Is it still too far away for the turret to detect it? Alright, so turret here has an incredibly short range. Cargo conveyors. Okay. Moving cargo to fabrication bay. All right. Got a neuromod. I should really stop. Yeah. Fuck you. Oh, what? I missed. Bullshit. Fuck you, assholes. Alright, so I can repair this thing? Door malfunction. No, I cannot repair that thing. Hmm. It's getting clear. Radioactive. Oh, storage room. Hey. I, uh, yeah, I, I know it. It's 688. Ah. Ow! God damn it, I fucking. I was looking at it. God, dumb. <sighs> Clive, we need to up the reload speed on the glue cannon. The uh, actuators are slow on this thing. Hey, neuromods, cool. 
All right, is that everything in here? Oh, I didn't even need to actually go into the, uh, I didn't need to know the code in order to get in. Interesting. Hey, can I make that jump? Ah, holy shit, I did. Oh, I was right about those EMP charges. That's, uh, transfer junk. Not, not what I wanted. Give me that back. Transfer junk, I said. All right. Is there any duplicates that I picked up? Doesn't look like it. All right. All right, so let's, I guess, scrap this out. Uh, God damn it, I have 22. All right, yeah, I'd like to make some additional uh, nine millimeter bullets. I have 27, now I have 57, wow. I feel like stealth bullets are gonna be really valuable. Oh, I can't. All right, but I can make another wrench. I don't know why I would ever do that. Hey, I found some darts. Wonderful files. I don't know what I just did, and I don't care, because I didn't want to read it. Uh, as I'm sure you might have noticed, there's an issue with one of the tanks near this black closet now. It's causing a bit of radiation. Uh, please take clear and spread the word until I can get what I need to clean this up. Hey, Mary. Gary Snow here. I work through services. I heard some scuttlebutt about a new dark gun you guys worked up. Possibly something about an assassin-style game in the Arbitum. Ar Arboretum and crew quarters? I want it. Thanks, Gary. Oh, that's neat. little fun relief. Alright, what's this? Artax Propulsion System. I bet you these are the exact materials I need in order to make an Artax Propulsion System. Hey look, an Artax Propulsion System. Hey look, great! What a fucking surprise. Hold space while falling or glide. Uh, hold space while falling to glide or slow your step. Really give, I really gave up on reading shit quickly, didn't I? Alright. So I need to go back. Oh. I think he noticed me. What are the chances? Hey! Hey, buddy. Hey. Oh, he just got zapped. I doubt he was the only one in here. You know what I'm saying? Did I just see something moving around up there? That's a fan. Don't worry guys, it's just a fan. There's Dr. Calvani's workshop. Hey, look at this stuff. Oh, now aren't I glad that I got fucking leverage? It's interesting how it shows the uh, sound. Like dark vision. Oh, I can take that. Fuck you.
Oh, this is actually where I needed to go. I hear one of the enemies, I think. Wait, this is where I... Fuck me. That's unlocked. Alright, so I need to... <sighs> Find Dr. Calvino's workshop key card. Access Dr. Calvino's workshop. Hardware labs. Alright. And then I need to get to Bellamy's room key from his body in, psych in Psychotronics. So Psychotronics is from... I can get to Psychotronics from... Palace lobby if there's an airlock, but I have to unlock the airlock first. So the only way to get to Psychotronics is from Guts. Guts. Now, Guts I can get to from the Arboretum. Ar Arboretum. Arbor. Arbor. Whatever. I'll figure it out later. Alright. I think I'm gonna cut the episode off here. It's been a good time recording. So, yeah, I feel like uh, we made a lot of progress in this episode. Kind of got some better weaponry, got some good ammo, got a uh, jetpack. And uh, the next episode's gonna pick up with us being in outer space, free floating and stuff. And it'll be really interesting to see how it controls because. Uh, I always hate space games where you're in space because I always feel like the controls suck shits. Call of Duty Infinite Warfare, looking at you. Alright, thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please leave a like, and if you subscribe, leave a comment saying that you subscribe so I then know that you actually did subscribe. I can always look at the subscribe counter, but I, that doesn't necessarily say your name or stuff, so I can't like say thank you. I don't know, it seems more personal. Anyways, thank you guys for watching, and I hope you all have a great day.